Hello everyone, this is Subhash S. Mishra. In this video, we will see few selenium multiple choice questions and answers. So, the very first question is, what is selenium? Select the best answer. So, we have these three options. So, please read all these options carefully and try to answer first on your own and then you see the answer. So, let me show you the answer. The correct answer is, selenium is the open source test automated tool to test web based UI which supports many different languages like Java, Python, Perl, PHP, Ruby and C has. We will move to the next question. Which one of the following is correct for web driver? You have to choose one option. Interface, abstract class, none. Think once before you answer this question. So, the correct answer is interface. We will move to the next question. Which of the following is not a component of selenium? Choose one option. Grid, RC, IDE, web driver, web element. Very easy question. So, the answer is web element. We will move to the next question. Which of the following languages is not supported by selenium? Again, a very easy question. So, the options are Java, ASP, Python, PHP, C has. So, the answer is ASP. We will move to the next question. What would be the outcome if you try to run below code? Web driver, driver equal to new web driver. So, choose one option. Here are the four options. Think carefully. What will happen when we will write web driver, driver equal to new web driver? So, the answer is compilation error. So, why you will see a compilation error? In selenium, web driver is an interface and you cannot instantiate an interface directly. You need to create an instance of a class that implements the web driver interface such as chrome driver, firefox driver and all right. So, you need to write web driver driver equal to new chrome driver or new firefox driver. You cannot write web driver driver equal to new web driver. We will move to the next question. How do you run the selenium web script driver on the chrome browser? So, the options are you see we have four different options. So, the correct answer is chrome driver. So, to run selenium web driver scripts on the chrome browser we need to use chrome driver. Okay. We need to write web driver driver equal to new chrome driver. Okay. We will move to the next question. Select the operating system which is supported by selenium web driver. Windows, Mac OS, Linux. So, here are the four options. So, the correct answer is all. We know Selenium supports all these operating systems Windows, Mac OS, Linux. So, the answer is all, the number four. Which of the following is not a type of weight mechanism available in Selenium? Choose one option thread dot slip, implicit weight, explicit weight, fluent weight. Which one is the correct answer? The answer is thread dot slip. We will move to the next question. Is implicit weight time applied to all elements in your code? Choose one option. Yes or no? Answer is yes. We will move to the next question. Select the correct statement for a fluent weight. Choose one option. So, we have all these four options. So, the answer here is both one and two. So, it looks for a web element repeatedly at regular intervals until timeout happens or until the object is found. Polling period can be set and the user can configure the weight to ignore any exceptions during the polling period. We will move to the next question. Select the correct statement about driver.close and driver.quit. You can choose multiple options here. So, here you see we have four different options. So, the correct answer is 2 and 4. Driver.close closes the current window and driver.quit closes every associated window with this driver and quits the driver. We will move to the next question. The format to write a custom XPath. We have four options 1, 2, 3, 4. You can see which one is the correct option. So, the answer here is 2 double slash tag name then at the rate attribute equal to attribute value. So, this is the right way to write a custom X path. We will move to the next question. Which of the below methods 
verify the presence of a web element on the screen you have to choose one option is displayed is present is enabled none so the answer here is is displayed is displayed returns true if the element is visible and returns false if it is not visible we'll move to the next question which of the below method can ensure that the web element is enabled or not you have to choose one option is active is enabled is present none which one is correct so the answer is is enabled it returns true if the element is enabled and false if it is not we'll move to the next question what would be the exception thrown by the web driver if the web page is refreshed after the element is located you have to choose one option no such element exception stale element reference exception element not visible exception or none here the correct answer is stale element reference exception you know this exception is thrown when a web element that was previously located is no longer present in the dom dom means document object model if the web page is refreshed or modified after locating an element the reference to that element may become stale leading to this exception we'll move to the next question which of the following expression is used for anything you need to choose one option so the answer here is dot star we'll move to the next question select the correct option on how to select an element that contains key automation you have to choose one option so here you see we have four different options so the correct answer here is the first one web element element equal to driver dot find element then by dot xpath contents so we are using contents method here contents then text function key automation okay we'll move to the next question which command you use to navigate to google.com so you have to choose one option so here you see we have four different options the correct answer is none we'll move to the next question in selenium web driver which method you use to navigate to google.com navigate to url or get url or go to url so here we have four different options so the correct answer is first and second navigate to url and get url we'll move to the next question selenium command for entering text into a text boxes we have four different options here send keys then send keys then send keys s is capital here then none so the correct answer is send keys the first one we'll move to the next question find elements locator method returns what you need to choose one option we have four different options here so the correct answer is list of web elements we'll move to the next question select the correct statement to maximize the browser window you need to choose one option so we have four different options here so the correct answer is driver dot manage dot window dot maximize so this particular statement is used to maximize the browser window we'll move to the next question what is the best call for finding multiple elements using xpath you need to choose one option so the correct answer here is find elements by dot xpath okay we'll move to the next question which of the following methods is used to clear the text in a text field using selenium you need to choose one option so here we have four different options so the correct answer is element dot clear the very first option so clear method is used to clear the text in a text field we'll move to the next question which of the following classes provides helper methods to select and deselect options on a select tag you need to choose one option so here the correct answer is select class so select class provides helper methods to select and deselect options on a select tag i hope all these selenium multiple choice questions are helpful to you if you like this video please press the like button share it with your friends and do not forget to subscribe our channel thank you